Kim's prediction. It's a horrible prediction. Bandai Namco will make a digital re-release -re -re of all three original Xenosaga games. If not physical, 60 bucks, one cartridge. Yeah, I can see that happening. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of, that's easy that's a them. That's a good deal, though. Considering how it is it's a good like, deal it's a hundred like, something to buy three it is. alone. <laughs> yeah. Two is probably... And keep in mind, you have to have a working PS2. <laughs> God. Ours kind of died once we finished Xenosaga 3. It yep. won't turn on. Um, I'm still shooting for the stars and hoping we get Hollow Knight, because supposedly that's coming this year. Hollow Knight Silk Song. I haven't seen anything on that. This year? Yeah. Well, really early this year, there was like this poster that Nintendo gave out, and they showed a bunch oh, of yeah. game titles that are supposedly coming this year. I remember you showed me that. <laughs> and the only one that we didn't know about was Hollow Knight. And I was like, that's coming this year? They didn't tell us anything. If Capcom is big enough that they wouldn't put in like a main show, uh, supposedly there is a Monster Hunter coming to the Switch this year. We have no idea what that is. Could be Monster Hunter Stories or something. Um... Oh, 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 and it starts. Here goes this. Hopefully the volume's okay. Doo -doo 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 -doo. You're okay with that sound? No, I will. It's better than the, the PlayStation turning on, if that's what you mean. That yeah. noise drives me crazy. All right. It's probably going to be like a bunch <laughs> of indie stuff. We don't really know. Well, it's partner showcase. That could be anything that is another developer is doing. <gasps> Monster Hunter! It is Monster Hunter! <laughs> it just said this! It's... Wait a minute. But what is it? I don't know. Uh... <laughs> uh... Is it just me, or does this look like a huge step backwards? Is this like Adventures on Puppy Island? Because... It, this isn't like an actual... This is a joke, right? ...mainstream title. Yeah, it can't be. We've got a rampage on our hands. <laughs> From the <laughs> trolls. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be a meme so quick. I know. That, that is a meme. That's perfect. Is that a Macau? That's a platypus. Wait, are these Frontier monsters? No, this is just new. That looks kind of interesting. Oh, is it a platypus or a crocodile? I thought it was a platypus. <laughs> that monster is Toby's in it. Toby? How, how did you say that? Magmalo. <laughs> Arzuros! No, I love Arzuros. Wagambi! Was he in it? No, I'm just saying. He probably Zeros will be. <laughs> I kind of like this weird-looking platypus like monster. I like it. I like these new monster designs. Yeah, I, I I really like them. This is for my that thing looks. Fun. That looks kind of frontierish, but you know, it's it's not that bad. Monster Hunter. Rise. We even knew what the title was. Wow. <laughs> even the title Should leaked. We well, world leaked as well, but. I mean, it's a step back from world, so I don't really. Yeah, but it's it running this... on the Switch. I'm sure the Switch came out and they were like, "We are missing some Switch money. This is not okay." So. Get a puppy and a kitty. So by doing this, all right, <laughs> I'm sold. Puppy, kitty, done. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, because it's it's dominant in the Monster Hunter series wherever you I'm are. I'm still playing World. Like. <laughs> oh. Okay. What do you, what does that mean? Another title? Another you mean your Hunter entire title? direct was it just one trailer, or is this also Monster Hunter somehow? I have no idea. Doesn't yeah, it's still Capcom. So this is stories. Monster Hunter. Oh yeah, that's true. Did I get both? Did I call both? <laughs> If Hollow Knight and Xenosaga are now in this, we call the entire stream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's stories. It seemed like a cute idea at first. Yeah. It played not the greatest. <laughs> well, we played the demo. We, that's true. We did. You know, we didn't play more demo. than that. We played the demo, and also this looks already looks a lot better than that demo for the 3DS that we played. I mean, look at that. As long as there's, you know. Actual background music and the environments and the, and the gameplay isn't as the gameplay wasn't that great. Oh, Legiana, they got new monsters in it. That was not okay. <laughs> well, I don't know if that was a thing in the regular stories or what. No, remember the giant head talking cat? Oh yeah. You forgot about that? That was really, really unsettling. <laughs> Anjanoth. That's him trying to look cute. <laughs> Didn't they just pronounce it Anjanoth? They just said it correctly and I didn't even realize it. Well, what it should be. Yeah. Anjanoth. They didn't say Anjanath. Well, I still have the theory that... Stories, uh... too. Yeah, well, a very uninspired name. Oh, they gave it... Why isn't it just called Why Stories, Wings they... of Ruin? Yeah, they should have just done that. Why wasn't it just Stories, Wings of Ruin? 
or just stories too. Either would have been fine, but I guess they're like gonna be both. Welcome to our stay tuned for Monster Hunter Direct after this presentation. All right. Okay. I was just gonna say I need to see a lot more from that Monster Hunter before I can justify spending sixty dollars on another Monster Hunter. I know, and it doesn't you know. look as you know. It's, I, I know. I'm so biased towards World now. Once I love World it. happened, I was like, just make a dumbed down World engine on a new Monster Hunter, and it. They kind of changed some things. I was noticing like the combat was a little different. Mm -hmm. We're clearly really excited about this game here too. Um, but like the combat looked like it was totally different. Like I feel like the blocking and attacking looked more like Dark Souls animations than Monster Hunter. Um, so hopefully they they made they took like what they learned from World and put it into an old Monster Hunter aesthetic looking game. The things that were kind of turning me off though was like riding on the dog that is straight up just running up a wall <laughs> and uh, Spider-Man slinging when there's nothing above your head and I don't know. I, the terrain looked a little weird but the monsters looked really cool. Yeah, and, I like the new design. And I know the Switch can do better than what they showed exactly. too and That's hopefully it's just confusing me hopefully it was just like an early access and they're still working on it and visuals because the switch can do a lot better than they that. said 2021 i mean I doubt that's pretty it. close to it's pretty close to release then yeah. March I think it was uh, yeah I doubt they're uh... as for fitness boxing that's what it's gonna look like guys it's coming out in December for everyone who wants fitness boxing an all new disguise game is here dude really oh that's how you're supposed to say it <laughs> I've been saying <laughs> it wrong for years I think I always said Disgaea uh, I didn't expect that Six. I also uh, never put the time in to play the others so someone gave us three to play and I never got around to it I have so many other things to play also I think that was for our PS3 and our three is kind of kaput now, right now. Max well, the three is isn't the controller. The controller is. is. <laughs> That's absurd. Right. I feel like if you needed to go that high, you just needed more zeros. Like for the, you know, like in Final Fantasy when you can just deal nine 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 nine, yeah, and it caps or like your HP goes to nine 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 nine, like. But if it needed to go that high, add another zero so that doesn't happen, you know? Because it made, like, hard mode on FF7R so much harder because you couldn't get better. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm, I keep getting thrown off, like, what kind of game is this? And then it shows something completely different. I'm like, what? Actually, it seems kind of fun. <laughs> Just messing with mob mobs and trying to piss them all off and get them against each other. Oh, yeah, that sounds like my kind of game. <laughs> well, that's what I want to see right there. The, well, that's, what's it's the a, combat? It's, a it's like a top-down strategy top -down game? Top-down strategy. It's like... If I had enough time in my life, yeah. See, like, the Switch is pulling this off, you know, and... I know. Like, that's why I'm this like... This looks so much... Like, imagine the Monster Hunter's environments looked like that. Well, obviously not the cities, but, you know, like... It's pulling Witcher 3 off. That was, like, our definitive, like... <laughs> right. It can play Witcher You have 3. no excuse anymore, because Witcher 3 is on the Switch. <laughs> Everything should look beautiful now. Version of this game swings you know, games like this sell really well, but... Showing them in a showcase like this is not the right audience to do it. Oh, this. Yeah. This is the one where they showed like a really impressive like animated cutscene and they didn't show any gameplay and we were like, well that was a cool video, but what's the game like? Finally. Yeah. I feel like well, we've been watching it. I feel like we've been watching it for a while. Oh, it's the... Balan World. Yeah, um, Sonic the Hedgehog team. Yeah. Doing it at Square. It's so weird. by the mysterious maestro Balan. Balan, I'm sorry. That's what you said. I said Balan. Oh, you did? Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> so wait, is it, is it Captain Toad? Kind of? No, the gameplay. I'm like, it's, it's kind of Captain Toady. Where, no, you can jump though. I don't know. If it's a... People still making uh, 3D platformer collectathons. I'm happy to see them. I w Kids should play them. They're great games. Kim should play Banjo-Kazooie. Manjo. Manjo. Uh -huh. My PS2 doesn't work, but my N64 still works. Can you imagine a new Banjo Kazooie? Like, they just give us a new Banjo Kazooie for this, that'd be outstanding. But what if it's like their other ones they did? 
Yeah. <laughs> that one, uh, that's not Banjo Kazooie. That was actually like is waiting some of the Star Fox games where it was designed Balan to be something Wonder else, we'll and they just threw an IP they had at it. Spring 2021. It's kind of a shame. That's how you kill franchises. I've been looking at trying to play something from X Seed because they've um they've made some good stuff. It's just I haven't played enough from them anymore. Those are and giant. In the river. Yeah, that was a little giant. You may even find us. <laughs> Those were, <laughs> Those all, were so all so giant. giant. All in love due to Stardew Valley. Yeah, this actually is basically just but, I an mean, amped up Stardew given... Valley. It's it, Rune Factory 5, so I'm sure the other ones right. have done the exact same thing. So it's just me seeing, like, oh, apparently Rune Factory has always just been a really good Stardew Valley. Saving the good stuff lasts. Oh, oh. oh. Was that not already on the Switch? Okay, maybe they have a second one coming. That was the second one. Oh. Ori and the Blind Forest is the first one, and Ori and the Will of the Wisps is the second one. I mean, it looks really great when it's working, you know, the first time. Like, here, if you watch someone play it and they know what they're doing, the, the game looks outstanding. Playing it yourself and you're like, wait a minute, that was a platform? Wait, wh where was I supposed to jump? I'm supposed to, how do, I, how do I stop this person? Oh god, it's just unforgiving, long load times, it's just, ugh. Not a big fan of Ori. And that was their big thing, huh? We have a Monster Hunter Direct? Are we watching this too? Well, that's the big thing, <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> that looks really nice, though. Wow. Wow! Good lord! Oh, and it comes with the first game? Yeah, it comes with the first game, too. It must be expensive. Wow, yeah, that's probably really expensive. <laughs> Tune for Monster Hunter that's it? No smash? Is this gonna start immediately, Oh, I just right? want this to be recorded. 26 is when I think another direct will come. Hello there, everyone. At this announcement we trailer. are so butthurt about leaving Nintendo at the wrong year. <laughs> See, now some of this looks really nice. Yeah, I know, but these are just pre-renders. Right, I, I hope this is not pre-rendered, because when it was in gameplay, it didn't look nearly that it good. It had those oversaturated colors that I see And with... really low poly trees. Yeah. Yeah, with, Nargakuga um... or something like that. Yeah, it's a Nargakuga top, I think. No. I don't know. Finally, it's not just Pepe's. We can have the good boy. The good boy. He's the good boy. <laughs> that looks bad. The running straight up a. Well, okay. uh, what was that? What is this? I don't know. I don't but know, you're it's... not like hunting things down anymore and gathering Are you? I mean, if that's a giant open world, no loading screens, which Switch can do, then really cool. Got an important letter. But it looks, it looks like so unrealistic. We've got a rampage on our hands. <laughs> <We've> <laughs> that's my new favorite meme right there. <laughs> Done. I don't know if the if the traversal wasn't so fantastical and over the top anime, because it smells like generations to me. Yeah. And, well, okay. How about this? I think the it looks better than generations. Oh, it does. It looks a lot better than generations. But I, I'm still catching whiffs of it every now and then. See, look at that. That looks like Dark Souls. Maybe that's maybe it was a lance. I don't know. It went by so fast. Be. Toby's a little instigator, that's what he is. <laughs> <clears throat> so this is like the Zenogre thing is the uh, the big bad. Their flagship. Yeah. <clears throat> Magmalo. Magmalo. Oh, is that, that a spider? Was that Nursilla? That... Yeah. Nursilla's so cool. But I saw like the webby like things. It could have just been Val. Yeah, so you definitely have this new. See, it's it's that insecty thing, whatever it is, where they like, I know they zip line, that that is so generations. And what I mean by that is changing up the gameplay and kind of forcing you to play a different way that makes it all anime over the toppy, and you pretty much have to play with it. Otherwise, you're at a huge disadvantage, and I don't like that. But so, the monsters look cool. Like how unenthused the, the translator is. Running up cliffs and making use of the. I mean, it's nice to move fast, so that's nice. The thing is, I never like Monster Hunter being portable. Um, it performs better as a console game. I've tried to play it portable, and I just get interrupted. I mean, like, if I'm out somewhere, you know? Actions we've added to this game. Yes, I'm really concerned. Places on the map, such as cliffs, which is awesome. I love that idea, but. The player carries several of these small bugs around, and they allow you to climb to a variety of places that would normally be out of reach. 
At least it's like a natural thing. So it's the new clutch claw. Huh. Is it really? He's so cute. Which I guess is better on portable, you know? When you start a quest, you'll be that looks yeah, see, that, look that does great. not look good. Single, seamless locale. Ugh. Well, seem thank God it's inexcusable anymore with your crazy load times you had on like of course, we've made the 3DS sure games. The How long can you run up something before you fall? I don't know. That's just silly looking to me. Yeah, like, it does like look silly. A little bit so I like that the little guys on the ground and like some of the environments are okay. They look pretty good. And they have endemic the life again. It looks like so. Yeah, it, it looks yeah. loads better than what Generations looks like on the Switch. It's just kind of weird that this is the next thing from Generations, and then we just have Monster in our world, just like way out here. <laughs> well, world, you can even, I don't want to say dumb down, but uh, make world run a lot easier for the Switch, but I would have preferred a new title like this, so this is cool. It's, it's both, but I know, but I really this is what concerns me so much, and they're highlighting it. I don't like it. Yeah. I like the idea, like you said, to move fast. Yeah. But I don't like just running up on the wall. I, I don't want Prince of Persia. I wanted Monster Hunter. And apparently even the Prince of Persia fans didn't want Prince of Persia. If you pay attention to that announcement. It's a Palamute. No, it's Good Boy. It's the Good Boy. See, I keep seeing textures. No, he's fine, because they did this in World. But he's the Good Boy. I just keep, keep, I keep seeing textures, like, when it's loading, that are just, like, copy and pasted everywhere. Yeah. Also, the pop-in is not so good. But it's on the Switch. I get it. And it's an open world. And I'm not even saying that Monster Hunter World doesn't have its flaws. Oh, yeah. It it's does. Monster Hunter World has pop-in, too. Yeah, and baked lighting still. Yeah, well, Capcom can't ever do good lighting. Okay. I would have been really shocked if they weren't here. He's blowing bubbles. He has a bubble wand. He's got a knife. Huh! Other. Oh, no. Wait a minute. They can bring him, too. Really? Even on a four-player one? That changes a lot. Next also, I now what do I do? Do I bring monsters. do I bring Pepe's or do I sacrifice them for the Good Boy Army? This might be the best monster hunter because it has the Good Boy Army. Are you gonna call every single one of them Good Boy? Yeah, just monster the Good game. Boy. Magma Mallow. That's not as hard to say as I thought. Like a magma marshmallow. It's great. <laughs> I like this bird. Yeah, I like it too. <laughs> It's like a crane. Yeah, it's like a giant angry crane. <laughs> He's using the old animations for wyverns. Yeah, I can see that. Though some of it is, it looks a little new. We've got a, a new. Um, he is like a blade tail, so he's like a mini Glavinus, or what? Well, no, he's more like a great Macau kind of a great little wyvern guy. It's just a new one. No, like this guy. Yeah, I know. Oh, okay. I like that we have an amphibian. That's nice. <laughs> I just can't tell. It's just a platypus, right? A platypus turtle. Giant platypus tortoise thing. Yeah. Okay. It's great. Oh, good. Yes, turf wars. I'm glad they still. Oh God, is he eating? Oh no! Oh no! Don't eat it! Don't eat the fuzzy boy. Base. Base. <laughs> it, it looked high poly enough. Like when it got close, like it, it looked nice. I'm hoping that the, there's a lot of cleaning up they're gonna do for um, the like end of it, but. A rampage on our hands. <laughs> I can't say <laughs> it's the third time you said that. The standard edition? Oh. Edition oh okay. At first, I was like, "Don't you pull a Pokemon? What are you doing?" Special layered armor for a golden retriever. You just want a golden retriever? Bring a golden retriever with me. Oh, that's the pre-order. It. So that's yeah. Also. We will be oh, cool! Really? I love that! About time you guys are games. finally doing this! Using the that I'm interested in. Not Palamute. Good boy. No, Palamute is the good boy. I know, I He's just... He's such a good boy! I forgot his name again. Oh, okay, that's good. Yeah, sure. I mean, I'm not gonna get stories, but... I mean, I can... It's Rise that I'm looking at, like, hmm... But... Which will go up You're gonna end up today. getting Rise, I have that feeling. I, I can't see how I'm gonna get away on this channel with not playing it, but... <laughs> you you actually play all the Monster Hunter games in their entirety on your I, channel I do. and show everything. I do. <laughs> and to me, it 
looks like six. They added new monsters and they added old ones from world. That must be six, right? You know, I could be disappointed with like watching the progression and moving around with that thing, but if it plays really well and it's really fun to like jump around and move like that, then who cares? I won't. I won't care at all. Yeah, I love the clutch claw. <laughs> yeah, um, it's it's clutch claw, but you can shoot it in the air, which. Uh, yeah. How come the music now is so much more triumphant? They're like, now for the real event! Oh, they have different music styles, you know that. I just realized throughout the entire video I had my mic turned really weird. So I hope you could hear us okay. <laughs> We're gonna watch the trailer again, because that's what we they- We watched the other one. Yeah. So I guess on closer inspection, I'm gonna- I don't know what more there is to see about, uh, stories, though. You know, um... I mean, we didn't really play stories, so... I, I thought I heard that stories did really well in Japan. I can believe that. Yeah, and, um... Because it's more RPG, The West know? is more interested in, uh, the Monster Hunter mainline series. You know, um, I would probably be much more into this game if it weren't for the, uh... What I'd consider kind of stale rock-paper-scissors combat. I just... I played it for that all, all of that demo, which was, what, three episodes long, maybe four? And I, by the end of it, I was like, uh... The fact that I could collect all the monsters, though, and get different forms like, of them... Like, that's fun. That's fun. <laughs> so, like, the base game, outside of combat, is fun. And I like seeing, like, this chibi-ish version of all the monsters. Yeah, right. There's chibis of everything, and you can ride on them and make them all your pets. You have your favorite ones. That's awesome. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe this one, like, changes up combat. Anjanath! She said Anjana. It's just because Handler can't pronounce it's anything. Not, it's not just Handler. <laughs> it's everybody in that game. She only has four fingers. They have four fingers in this game? No, that lady did. Oh. Uh, maybe that's like what elves are, but instead of, yeah, no, Wyvernians no, or something. Yeah. Wyvernians okay. have three fingers. They do? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I just want to see what other adorable monsters the monster they have in this universe. If I could just go through a model well, viewer of all chibi monsters from stories, monsters that's all I'd want. <laughs> <laughs> like, so this is, it, like, the Rathalos from the first game has now produced an egg somehow. With the mass oh, that's, yeah, that's, what yeah, that one that's is. the one with the yeah. cross yeah. scar on its face. I don't know why it took me that long to put together. I, 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 really? I cared so little about the story in that game. And it was called Monster Hunter Story, so I was like... Oh, that's your big pet peeve, I mean. Well, you have a story huge was, pet peeve. The Monster Hunter can't tell stories? No, 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 when something's called story and oh, geez. it's not good at writing You're making a story. cave story yeah, joke. Yeah, that's your problem. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, don't. That looks like a. Don't put your worst foot forward and then claim it's the best part of your game. But still, only played the demo. I don't know if that story was any good. Plus, stories get the pop. Version. They do. Well, that makes sense. You're making a chibi version or something. I saw the Baryoth one. It's so cute. Yeah, they have bear. We saw Baryoth and a a Los. Do they have a Palico? No, I don't think so. I didn't see it. Monster Hunter they both leaked. <laughs> what has it leaked this year? Websites and social Hyrule media Warriors media didn't leak. Right, right, right. So please go check them out. <laughs> and Ratchet and Clank is Ratchet and Clank yesterday. didn't leak. Um, other than that, online I'm pretty sure everything else leaked. And Capcom the well, I'm looking at the Nintendo stuff because everyone's got their eyes on Nintendo because they're not making real directs. They're just doing this partner yeah, stuff. Yeah, but I've been kind of paying attention to Square and like. That's definitely. I don't think for watching this a lot of Hunter world Direct. leaked. He called it a Monster Hunter Direct. They, they were probably dying to do that after all of their uh, developer diaries. They're like, uh, we yeah. wish we could just call these directs, but we're not with Nintendo right now because we made a horrible decision. <laughs> <laughs> they hate us. Well, I mean, can you imagine if they, instead of making that decision, like, oh, we want World to look really spectacular back then, they're like, you know what? Nintendo's got this this new console coming we need to develop for it at the same time i don't remember what year the switch was coming out then when world i think i don't know but they definitely made they would a, have had postponed it i think they definitely made a big oopsie with that one but still i love it on the playstation yeah so yeah, and it, it world is great on the PlayStation. I just wish that they found some way to get it to port over. I just because... wish the loading times on the PS4 yeah. were better. And you know what? If they did try a port, and I'm sure they gave it a shot, um, the loading times I could imagine would be 
atrocious and it would set really? the switch on fire <laughs> yeah so this is probably for the best that they just develop a new thing um and they've kind of stopped numbering the games which is really going to confuse that's... me no no that's helpful i like that they stopped doing well that. yeah it makes each one feel a little better and it's not like this one's better than the other it's like i'm not but... sure why final fantasy still keeps numbering it well when i know it's but, so irrelevant but it is but in monster hunter uh, since i've played them all i look at them and like the generation of that monster's or origin was from like pokemon you're like that's from the fifth generation like toby's oh, okay. in it uh arzuros is in it he's from the third and then you see like the new stuff oh you're from the sixth Right? Right? It's been years sure. since Monster Hunter World, so, I mean, come on, right? I know. Right? So, I don't know. I, I even said, like, what is in the last, um, did I say it in the Sony one? Or, like, we're expecting a Monster Hunter. Oh, I don't I, think, I think so. I, I think I did. I don't think you did. Oh, the Devil May Cry thing. And it said Capcom. I was like, oh, well, we're expecting yeah. a new Monster Hunter. So when's the new Monster Hunter? Um, though, um, I forgot to mention that all the leaks were saying it's coming out on Switch. So, that was that. Oh, my YouTube's trying to play something else. They finally turned their stream off. All right, so uh, speaking of which, we should do the same thing. So that's interesting. I'm glad we both filmed that, right? I still think... Kim really didn't want to be in here. She was too tired today. <laughs> direct September 26th. That's when they said we're getting more information. Real Nintendo Direct. A real Nintendo... For Hyrule Warriors. Hyrule Warriors. It could just be a video on Hyrule Warriors. It could, they just could post something to Twitter again. I don't know. They could. Yeah, could just be that. But, but they did, like, announce it at the end of that trailer. Mm -hmm. Like, more information. And speaking of leaks, other stuff September we've 26. heard, there's other stuff coming this year. Like a certain Metroid game. Not Prime 4, but a new 2D Metroid is supposedly coming. It leaked with... Mario 3D All-Stars with the new Paper Mario before any of these were even out. Uh, Pikmin 3 coming. All this stuff was leaking. And supposedly Metroid was in there with it. And now we've gotten all of the leaked things. Even the Monster Hunter. Minus Come on, Metroid. we're coming up on the holiday here. Let's start Make planning Make it the holiday things. title. They already said that Breath of the Wild 2 was delayed and couldn't be the new holiday title like it was intended to be. And so it must be Metroid... Uh, please? Maybe, I don't know, probably not. Anyway, um, that was a thing, and that was a cool thing. I'm glad I watched that thing. Yeah, that was a thing. The showcase yesterday is better. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. You just got so many people to dislike <laughs> this video. They were both really good. <laughs> they were good, but... As a Nintendo partner showcase? Okay, as a partner Come on. showcase. Come on, get your good. expectations in check here. Th that was really good. I just want a real direct. I'm sorry. Why? Yeah. okay. <laughs> Anyway, that's all the time we have for this video. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Remember to like the videos, contrary to what Kim just said, and subscribe for more. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.